fotožiky. That's less than three, so it's one or two. Yeah. That is at least one, because any square must be at least one. That is more than that, and is therefore at least two. But we already have a two in this row, so that can't be two, it is at least three. That is more than that, and is at least four. This is more than two, and is therefore at least three. I'm ignoring that for the moment, to illustrate a point. That that is at least three, and that is at least three, and they can't both be three. So the two of them together are at least three and four, and that is more than both of them. For that to be more than both of, more than two other things, which are each more than two, it must be at least five, which is the highest value any square can have, so I can put that in. The fact there's a three there actually tells me that is four, and makes it easier to get the five, but I wanted to illustrate that logic. So here we have one and three, and we know which way around they are because of that. We already have a one in this column, so that is at least two, so that is at least three. But it could also be five. What else have I got? Now that there is a five in this column, that is at most four. Therefore that is at most three, therefore that is at most two. It could be one or two. So that's at least one, that's at least two, that's at least three. Doesn't help much. And that can be anything except five. That must be more than four, and therefore is five. Which doesn't change that. It does mean that can't be five. So that is at least two, therefore that is at least three, and it can't be four or five, so it must be three. That is less than three and can't be one, and therefore must be two. And five can't go in that row because there's already five in that row. Can't go there because whatever's there has to be less than whatever's here. Can only go at the bottom. That five means that is at most four. So what? What are we left with? We are left with one and two to go here. We already have a two in this row. So two can't go there. That must be one. That must be two. Four or five, one, two or five, one, two or four, three or four. There. That's at least one, because any space is at least one. That's more than that, is therefore at least two. Can't be two, so is at least three. That is more than that, and is therefore at least four. And it can't be five, so that has to be four. That is less than that, and there is therefore at most three. Can't be one or two, so it's at least three. It's three. So that is less than three. That is still one or two. But I've got three, four, and five in this column. The remaining spaces must be one and two, and there's already a two in this row. So the two can't go there. It has to go there. And that can only be one. That's one, two, and five. I'm left with three and four. There's already a three in this column. So that can only be four and the three can only go there. I am left with one, two, and five. This row already has a one and a two, meaning that can only be five. And these must be one and two. This row already has a two, so this can only be one, and the two can only go there. Which leaves a one for that row, a four for that row, and a five for that row. Four is more than one, and that's a full set. One, two, three, four, five. Job done.